If something doesn't look quite right about your reflection in your video, or you've got words on the screen that are backwards, then there might be one thing that you can do. So today we're talking about how to get your mirror image when you are creating videos. Let's get right into it. If you're new here, my name is Liz and I help coaches and consultants add video to their business. Make sure you subscribe so that you never miss any of my future content. Now, why are we talking about such an obscure topic? Well, in fact, this plagues people every single day when they are creating videos. I was recently on a call with a group of women and one of them said that it drives her crazy how it always shows the mirror image of her real self whenever she tries to take selfie style videos. And I totally get it because this is how a lot of our devices are already set up. Not only that, but if you're ever shooting a video where you have words in the background, then if you find that they're flipped over, then this again might be the reason for it. But don't worry, because there are ways that you can set up your devices so that you can get the image you want. In some instances, people actually prefer one or the other. They feel like one of those images actually makes them show up a little bit better and look a little bit more confident on camera. So whichever way you prefer is totally fine. Whatever works for you is the best way to go about it. So today I'm gonna to show you three ways that you can get this done. The first is on Zoom when you're in a meeting. The second is just from the camera of your phone. And the third is when you're creating a video on Instagram. So let's jump onto my computer. The place where I'm going to show you how to actually mirror your image is on Zoom. So if you're in a Zoom meeting, then you can easily do this within a couple of seconds. This might be the way that you see me if I join a Zoom meeting right now. You can see that the words behind me are actually backwards. So if I wanted to flip that around, then what I would do is go to my video settings. So right now I'm recording my entire screen so that you can see everything I'm doing. So in Zoom, come down to this little arrow, pull up your video settings, and then here you are simply going to check or uncheck this. Look what happens. If I say not to mirror my image, I'm going to get it like this, which means now the words are straight. When people see me, those words behind me are going to be straight. And I probably look a little bit different to you too, because now it has actually unmirrored that. So this is one way that you can do it in Zoom. The second thing we're going to look at is how to record a normal video using your normal camera on your phone and then how to flip that image. So let's do that. Now we're interrupting this video so that I can remind you to subscribe. I think you should do that first. And if you're looking for a resource so that you can get started with video at home, be sure to look for it in the description below. Just click on the link and I will send you that right away. Now let's get back to our video. So now I'm sharing my phone screen and I'm doing this simply so that I can walk you through the actual steps. It's going to be the same whether you do it on Android or on iPhone, except on Android, you actually might have to download a plugin or a driver. So go to your camera first. Here's that. And here I am ready to take a quick video. So let me just take the video first. Hi there, I'm doing a test video so that I can demonstrate to you how to actually mirror that image. Okay, so that was my test video. And then here we can see the video in the corner. Okay, so that has played for you. So now what I can do is on the iPhone particularly, I can tap into the edit feature, which is at the bottom. On your Android, you will also have something like edit or settings. So tap into that. When I do that, I get all of these options, which are as usual. What I'm going to do is come down to this crop setting, tap that. And now at the top, it will show me different ways that I can flip this video. If you use this setting, it's going to actually turn your video counterclockwise and clockwise. So that's not what we really want. Instead, we want this setting here. So let's tap that. And now you can see I've gotten the mirror image. So this basically means that you can play with this and just see which of these two images you like more. And then just set it like that and then click done at the bottom. Once you do that, then your video will now be in that image the way that you want it. So again, when you're on Android, go to those settings from within the video that you have shot and then see whether you actually need to download another app or a driver. Sometimes your Android, if it's a Samsung, for example, might ask you to download the video editor app. So just do that and then walk through the steps and it's exactly the same. 
So the other thing I'm going to show you is how to actually do this if you are recording something in Instagram. I know that it drives people crazy when they're recording stories or when they're recording reels, for example, and they don't have their image the way that they want. So let's jump into Instagram. And then I will tap into my profile pic so that I can create a new story and we'll tap the photo there. So now here I am. What you have to do actually is use a filter. There is a filter on Instagram that will flip your image for you. So let's scroll through all of the filters at the bottom and come to the area where we can browse these effects. I don't really want this one, even though that one's cute. So go to the magnifying glass and then type flip mirror. And then you'll get a bunch of them, but the one with this blue circle at the top is the one that I really like to use. So there's that. And that has actually flipped the image already. So let's get out of there so that we can use that. And you can see that this image is now flipped. Now, if this is the one that you prefer, then you can shoot with this image. Or if you don't like that one and you prefer the usual one that you already have, then you can just go here and that has flipped that again. Now, if you want to create a reel using the same feature, it's also as easy as that. You simply tap on your create button. You want to create a reel. And then you go to the effects and then you find that same flip mirror one, use that effect, and then there I am. So that's flipped. And if I don't like that, then I can just tap out of there and use one of the other filters. Now remember, some people have a real preference as to whether their mirror image or their actual image shows up on video. So whichever one is the preference for you, just go with that. You don't have to explain yourself to anyone or start telling people, oh, this looks a little different because I have my mirror image. Nobody cares about those details. Set everything up in a way that it makes you feel really comfortable with the output that you get from that video, and then you will feel far more relaxed and confident actually putting them out. So if you like this video, I hope you will give it a like and share it off with one of your friends. Be sure to subscribe because every single Tuesday, I bring you a new video showing you how you can add video to your business. So until next time, take care.